everyone and welcome to episode 2 of what's in a shopaholics wardrobe and it's already episode 2 i asked all of you what day would you like the series to have its every episode release and most of you voted for sunday sunday won by a massive margin so here it is as blurry as it is but you can see it is the most filled compartment in my wardrobe let's begin this is one of my oldest t-shirts i bought this from forever 21 then we have my most favorite t-shirt it's from zara from the join life collection it's a plain black perfectly fitting t-shirt and i wear this most days i have like four of these in my wardrobe not kidding oh then i have a plain black bodysuit from h&m i have worn this at least 50 times not exaggerating i think after this video like at the end of this video we will have 90 percent of black clothes in here we have another <gasps> completely oh god i feel so bad completely ruined red t-shirt from zara oh no look at this i'm still going to keep it any which ways because it's ruined from the back and that's i'm gonna keep it Oh, this is the same uh, red t-shirt but in a black. I haven't worn this yet because I've developed a paunch and I'm not comfortable with it being shown. So once we get that back in, that's coming out. This one, I am not so sure. I love it but I haven't worn it yet. So that's making me think if I want to keep it or not. Another one of my favorites. Surprisingly, it's not black. You haven't seen this in the haul yet. You will see it soon. But it's a graphic t-shirt from Levi's. It's a it, it's a really nice one. I think it's a classic. It's a pink t-shirt from Zara. It has little frilly sleeves. I have worn this so much and I think the time has now come. Although this suits me quite a lot. We'll have to see. Oh, it's a mesh t-shirt. This is from Shein and this too I have worn at least 40 times. Oh, this one I wear a lot. I think it looks very, very smart. What is this? I have workout pants in the half sleeves compartment. And that too inside out, so there's a possibility that these aren't washed. Oh god, now everyone will think I am gross. Gross but real for you. This is another one of my favorites. I like it. I like it a lot. It's a cheetah print? No, leopard print. Either one of those. A really colorful and printed t-shirt. I've worn it quite a lot, but I haven't worn it in your recent past. If you haven't seen this, if you haven't seen this, you... You... You have seen this. It's a plain v-neck from Forever 21, but I'm not the biggest fan of this. You haven't seen this. You haven't seen this. You haven't seen this. Yep. This is a crisscross v-neck mesh t-shirt, uh, again from Shein worn this uh, around 15-20 times oh but this one i surely love how could i forget this one it says limited edition in spanish and i know this because of you guys <laughs> this one is from mango it says player please i mean i am not a fan of uh, cheeky comments like these but i did not realize what it wanted to say i was just getting it for a massive discount i got this just for around 225 rupees so i didn't uh, think twice i liked how it looked and i ordered it and i still like how it looks this one i'm planning to convert into a little makeup bag because it has these changing sequins which are very tough to change but yeah that's the plan for now this one is super old i got this for 100 rupees from my regular t-shirt wala at borivli station who i think will be shut mostly now since most stalls have been shut by the bmc um i have mixed feelings but mostly positive feelings towards this happening because uh, the, the cleaner the what do i want to say the more open the more space available as roads I'd appreciate that, even if that means we won't get to sweet shop. I kept this for a DIY. It's my very, very old Forever 21 crop top. I've worn this also 50 times. DIY pile kidda hai I hope these are not cycling shorts because that's going to embarrass me. Oh no, this is my AliExpress t-shirt. I've worn this quite a lot too. I, I love the fit of this. But again, it's a crop top, so I'm not going to wear it right now. I'll put this in the DIY pile. Oh, this is my Zara V-neck. Worn this multiple times. I used to wear it for meetings with a black blazer, blue jeans and my formal shoes and I still love that look. I haven't worn this in quite a while. 
it's a mesh embroidered tee from Shein. I love this but it doesn't fit me at the moment so I am either going to keep it in the future pile or I'm going to wear it at home. Let's see. I love this one. I absolutely love this one. It's a bodysuit from H&M. Again worn this multiple times. A plain white from Zara. What is this? Oh my god. I think this one should have green tea stains on it. It's a massively long knot tie <laughs> t-shirt. I don't know what was I thinking when I bought this. I paid 690 rupees for this. One of my old favorites which I'm sure doesn't fit me anymore. It's a crop top from Forever 21. Yeah, this is an H&M t-shirt. I'm not very very keen on so this is definitely going ah this white crop top from zara i've never worn this by itself i bought this for layering but i haven't used it for layering either good job Haley. this is uh, one of my favorites i've worn this way too much and i'm definitely gonna wear it more i think my wardrobe will consist a lot of black white grays and reds hmm. oh my v-neck uh, zara this too i have worn a lot when i'm in the mood for loose clothing days the red t-shirt which is super close to my heart, uh, this one is in pink, the same style. This one is less ruined though, that means I've worn this much less. And the last two, I think 90% of this stuff is from Zara. Uh, this one is also from there, the Join Life grey t-shirt. And this spirit, oh I forgot how much I loved this one. Love it. I first thought this would make me look like a Hawaiian lady but it doesn't. And at the back we have my Beacom books. Because after I was done studying, I literally wanted to give them to the Radiwala the very next day and my parents were like, Bas, pohot overconfidence ho gaya, wait till the results. So my results aren't out even now. That's why they're at the back of my wardrobe. They should be here by the end of January though. I'll be putting all the crop tops at the back because at the moment, as I shared with you, I'm not comfortable with wearing crop tops. And I'll be putting all the t-shirts I'll be wearing right now in the front. Let's go. Today I don't have mom to roll these for me. I actually wanted to sleep right now uh, and as I'm looking towards a healthier lifestyle every day but cleaning really makes me peaceful, makes me happy and hence I decided that I'll probably sleep happier if I do a whole compartment and go to bed. Also I am keeping the red one in this and not the same one in pink because the red one somehow is still softer even though I've worn it more and the pink one I feel is not that soft and has lost its colour. I am literally attempting to roll these in mid-air for you so that the time lapse doesn't get boring. So right now I'm in the mood to wear very loose t-shirts and fitting jeans and boots and that's my go-to outfit every single day. See, I had told you this will easily be fixable once all the burden is taken out. This one is also a slim fit white t-shirt so I'm putting this one at the back too right now. Don't get me wrong, uh, I have no issue with ponch, uh, with a ponch or any sort of a body structure. It just depends on your own comfort level. So all the printed t-shirts from Zara are basically from the same range. They have this 590 range where they have really awesome prints. They've come out with this range very recently actually and I love that. And in the sale they're like for 390 at the moment. Unfortunately, I am not keeping this. It's a beautiful top but even though I have it since months, I haven't worn it. So this has to go out. Even this shiny little black top is going. This one, I'm not sure how much do I love the style now, the frilly collar and the frilly sleeves. So I think I'm just going to wear it at home for the time being. And hence it goes in my homewear section, which is up there. Oh, it's not in the frame. It's basically here, like the topmost section there. Yeah. 
that does it i think i should move out yeah look at this it was so messy beforehand we have done it again i am currently looking at building my wardrobe and including nice tops and uh, not having just t-shirts so i will slowly be getting rid of uh, some of these t-shirts as well but currently i am very very proud of these two sections like look at how neat and empty these look so yeah thank you so much for joining in and helping me clean this it's it's it feels like i have but load of friends around me and they are looking at the t-shirts i don't want anymore and helping me decide which ones i want to keep and which ones i don't so thank you so much for giving your precious time and i love you so much i will see you in the next episode on next sunday until then watch my other videos which i will be uploading through the week and yeah be very very happy bye